Hi, Alex here, and in this short video I want to tell you about the benefits of long tail keywords. Long tail keywords have two major advantages. The first one is that they convert better. Long tail keywords tell you exactly what the searchers are looking for, and if you can provide it to them, your conversion rates will go through the roof. For example, someone searching for the keyword weight loss is not telling you exactly what they need, because you really don't know if they are looking for an exercise routine or a diet plan or pills or research or advice or one of the other hundreds of weight loss related topics. On the other hand, someone searching for meal replacement shakes for weight loss is telling you exactly what they need and if you can provide it to them, you'll convert most of your visitors into buyers. And this keyword is getting 1,900 exact match searches a month. Also, traffic coming from long tail keywords is much easier to monetize because people making long tail searches are further along the buying cycle. And the second major advantage of long tail keywords is that they are easier to rank for. Ranking in the top 3 for a term like weight loss would be great because of all the traffic you will get from it. But achieving and maintaining top rankings for these kinds of keywords is very expensive because of tough competition. And it takes a long time to do, sometimes years. But achieving high rankings for a term like HCG injections for weight loss, a keyword that gets 2,400 exact match searches a month, can be pretty easy and inexpensive due to the low number of sites properly optimizing their own page and off-page SEO for this term. Most of the sites ranking for long tail keywords are there by lack of a better option, so you can rank for these keywords very fast. Okay, but how do you go about in finding long tail keywords that have a nice search volume? It used to take me about 5 hours to see through a process I used to do manually, but in the back of my mind I always knew that it was something that could be automated, and that's why I decided to create Stealth Keyword Digger. With Stealth Keyword Digger you can find thousands of long tail keywords with nice search volume at the push of a button. Here's how it works. There are two main ways to use Stealth Keyword Digger. The first one is to find a broad range of keyword ideas for one seed keyword. So let's say I want to achieve top rankings for keywords in the weight loss niche. I would put my keyword here weight loss and then select a country and a language and if I want my keywords uh, research to be done for local or for global. I'm going to choose global for this demo and then just hit start. Stealth Keyword Digger takes about 15 to 20 minutes to, to complete the process, the whole analysis process. So I'm going to pause the video and resume it when it's done. Okay, so as you can see, these three fields that were empty before are now filled with keywords. And from one keyword, the software has gathered 3,536 keywords without duplicates and with good search volume. So let me explain what Stealth Keyword Digger just did. It took your seed keyword and went to the Google Keyword Tool and retrieved the top 100 keywords based on their search volume related to that keyword. Then it gathered more keyword ideas by using Google Instant, Amazon, YouTube, Yahoo and Bing. From 100 keywords it produced 2134 keywords without duplicates. Then it went into the Google Keyword Tool again and checked the search count for each one of these 2134 keywords. But not only that, it also gathered more keyword ideas that those keywords generated that had a nice search volume. So now you have thousands of potential winners here. Long tail keywords with nice search volume. But sorting to this list manually will take you hours. So that's where the real magic of Stealth Keyword Digger comes into play. This option here allows you to create CSV files with the search range you choose and if you want that search range to be for global or for local monthly searches. So let's say in this case I want to create a CSV file with a range from 1000 to 3000 exact match searches a month and I want it to be for global monthly searches. I would just hit export and I would name it demo test and hit save. Now I'm going to pause the video and we can check out that file. Ok, so we're inside the CSV file we just created and as you can see it has four columns. The keyword, the global monthly searches, the local and the approximate cost per click. And it has 425 keyword ideas. And if we were to just quickly browse through this keyword list, I'm sure we can find some potential winners. Ok, so here's one 
how to lose weight while breastfeeding. It gets 1,300 exact match searches a month. Here's another one. Does green tea help you lose weight? It has a CPC of 425 and it gets 1,900 exact match searches a month. So let's see if we can find one more. Healthy smoothie recipes for weight loss. It gets 1,600 exact match searches a month. So as you can see, in this CSV file, there's a wealth of ideas for keywords and for sub niches in the weight loss niche. And this is just one segment from all the keyword lists that Stealth Keyword Digger just gathered. And the other good thing is, is that this CSV file is in a format that you can import into Stealth Keyword Competition Analyzer to do competition analysis of all of these keywords. The other way you can use Stealth Keyword Digger is to find a tight set of keywords that only contain your seed keyword. So let's say I'm promoting digital cameras. I will put here digital cameras and now choose this option here. Only show ideas closely related to my keyword and hit start. The process will take the same about 15 to 20 minutes. So I'm going to pause the video and resume it when it's done. Okay, so it's done. So from one seed keyword, digital cameras, we have 2,526 keyword ideas. Now we're going to export our CSV file, but now we're going to do it from 1,000 to 5,000. Remember that all of these keywords here now have the word digital camera in them. So we're going to select higher searches and we hit export. We're going to name it demo2. I'm going to save it. I'm going to pause the video and we're going to resume it inside the CSV file. Okay, we're inside the CSV file we just created. As you can see, we have 133 keyword ideas. All of these keywords contain the word digital camera. And as you can see, just by looking here, we have some really good long tail keywords. Best digital camera under $200. It gets 4,400 searches a month. Digital SLR camera reviews 2011. It gets 2,900 searches a month. And you might say, well, now it's 2012. So that keyword is no longer relevant. It's no longer relevant, but it will give you a good idea on what keywords to target on 2012. So you would target the keyword digital SLR camera reviews 2012. And you know you're going to get something similar to this 2,900 searches a month. And nobody is optimizing their websites for that keyword. Here's another good keyword idea. Fisher Price Kit Tough Digital Camera. It gets 1,900 searches a month. And remember, these are exact mic searches a month. So they're as close to reality as possible. 